Yeah, Elle, it is the most in a swarm of earthquakes that we have seen at once at the mountain in more than 15 years. However, the message tonight from experts like you both just reiterated there, do not worry about this. This is not atypical. It is not cause for concern. An unusual event at a Washington landmark. Hundreds of small earthquakes tracked at Mount Rainier Tuesday. We call it a swarm of earthquakes when a bunch of, in this case, very tiny earthquakes happen without a sort of a main shock aftershock. At points up to several logged a minute, but none of them ever big enough to be felt on land. How concerned should the general public be? At this point in time, I want to be really clear, this is not really cause for concern. Earthquake swarms are not uncommon here. They happen once or twice a year. They're just usually a lot smaller than this. The last time it was on this kind of scale was about 2009, so 16 years ago. So far, no evidence of any changes to the ground surface and volcanic activity is still normal. But scientists will keep a close eye and send more updates if needed. We're certainly paying attention. A swarm like this is an unusual event. And uh, we'll see how things develop over the course of today and the coming days. So this is a very typical, if infrequent, event for Mount Rainier. It doesn't mean something bigger is growing. People we spoke to at the base of the mountain weren't too nervous about it. It's certainly not something I'm like afraid of or especially concerned of. Diego Rodriguez lives near Paradise. He works in Ashford at the National Park Inn. It's definitely like in the back of your mind, I think, at all times when you're here. But it's not so significant that you're like, I mean... Oh, no, I hope it doesn't happen, right? It's on extensive reporting in the past on earthquake risk across our region and all the ways that you can prepare for these natural disasters before they hit. You can find all those past stories up on our website right now at Cairo7.com. Reporting live in Seattle, Madeline Natalie Cairo, 7 News. Maybe we should repeat again. There's nothing to be worried about from yeah. there.